Okay, we're out here at the drum kit in the main drum room and we're getting ready to uh, track the song. So I got my chart here on my music stand. I got my Bluetooth keyboard so I can uh, uh, start and stop. And if I need to go to a bar number, I wrote them on the chart for some reason. I can do that. I just type it in. And um, I have my in-ear monitors, the Shure E5, E405 monitors. And I have the here back in-ear station back here. And uh, I have all the different stems and the click and the drums and everything coming up on that so I can create a little mix here in my ears uh, to track with. So um, we're going to give this thing a shot. Usually with this sort of session, um, I'll talk ahead of time to the artist or the producer about sort of a direction. And uh, uh, sometimes, you know, they'll say, hey, give us two different versions or something. So maybe the first thing we'll do is come up with a version that we think it should be and then, uh, or do what they think it should be and then come up with a version that we think it should be. I'm not sure either one, but sometimes we'll take two different approaches to the song or a couple different approaches uh, or attitudes depending on what the discussion was. But for now, since we don't have much direction for it, it was just, can you play what you hear on the, on the track? So I'm going to just attempt to do that. So here we go.
Okay, so that was take one, our basic approach to the song. So now I would go and uh, listen to that performance and take some notes and see what I dug or didn't dig and like to change and then maybe come back and take it again. I'm not sure. It depends on, but uh, let's go take a listen. <laughs> 